This story comes to us from the patriotledger.com. We're going to talk about another mass hole. But this guy, you guys might be calling this guy a hero. I don't know. But uh, you can't write this. You can't make this stuff up. <clears throat> this is going to be a... I could see this being a local TV show there uh, on their local network. But at a Cohasset, Cohasset, Massachusetts, police say a Cohasset man barricaded himself inside a Cushing Road home after he tried to cut through a door at the town's police station with a chainsaw. I love this guy. And he's facing a dozen charges, including child endangerment and assault with a dangerous weapon. How does child endangerment figure? Brian Buckley, 35 of 37 Cushing Road, is charged with assault with a dangerous weapon, three counts of property damage, two counts of child endangerment, resisting arrest, driving to endanger, driving without a license, disorderly conduct, disturbing the peace, wanton destruction of a tree, and a partridge in a pear tree. Uh, no, authorities said he is being held without bail until his arraignment in Quincy District Court. <clears throat> now, Cohasset Police, and I've, uh, this was from last week, the story, I think, because I think he already went to court. Uh, but going on, the Cohasset Police Chief William Quigley told the media outlets at the scene that the man later identified as Buckley was taken to South Shore Hospital for mental health evaluation. <laughs> Yay! Got a police door with a chainsaw. <laughs> you think he's a little woohoo? The two children in the home at the time of the incident were not harmed. Um, now, how is it child endangerment if they were in the home and he was down at the police station doing all this? I mean, well, he barricaded himself in the home, so they're saying he put the children in danger of those cops when he barricaded himself. I get that. Now, police said in a statement that officers received a frantic call from the civilian desk attendant at the police station about 2.30 p.m. Sunday. This was last Sunday before reporting that a man had driven over the lawn of the police station, hit a tree, and then entered the lobby, revving a gas-powered chainsaw. In old uh, Chevy Chase fashion from National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, right? Uh, <laughs> I love movies. Police said Buckley damaged the lobby of the station with a chainsaw and was chopping at the security door, attempting to get into a restricted area where the attendant was sitting. <laughs> he wanted that traffic ticket done away with. Buckley then fled, and officers tracked him to his home at Cushing Road. Police said he began yelling at the officers from inside his home and dangled two small children in front of a second-story window. Why did he do Oh, he said, I got kids. Don't be coming in here all reckless. That's all he was saying. Police put out a tactical alert, which drew police officers in from surrounding towns, including Hingham, Hull, Sitwati, I guess that's what the, Sit, and Norwell. Is, do you pronounce that Sitwati? Sitwati? Sitwati. Sitwat. I don't know. Um, a regional SWAT team and hostage negotiators from the Metropolitan Law Enforcement Council were called to the scene. After hours of negotiations, police said Buckley became more erratic and SWAT supervisors got permission to go into the home due to the danger of the children. <clears throat> now, they used tasers to arrest Buckley, who allegedly resisted arrest. They always do, right? The children, a boy and a girl younger than five, were taken from the home by police and reunited with their mother and grandfather at the scene. They were not injured. And, of course, there was a shelter in place until they got everything settled uh but this guy man he and i wonder how big a news this is in massachusetts i, I had it in california but there's just so much more i want to say about this and i can't really think you know it's just i'm just picturing this guy going and crashing in and run cuts through the front door goes in and goes to the security door <laughs> the person behind the window is like oh my god <laughs> 